Welcome to Behind the Bar by Grey Goose. Today we're going to elevate our summer cocktail game with two quick and easy tasty recipes. First, Leon. Yes. Super easy, super approachable, and the good thing about this cocktail is you only need two ingredients to be able to create it. One and a half ounces of our strawberry lemongrass Grey Goose essences and top it off with a little bit of club soda. Great thing about this cocktail is we're gonna build right into our glass, so there's no additional barware that's needed. And I love the glass you're using, but I also think it's really important to point out that a simple build like this can be made in a beautiful spritz glass like you have, or maybe a rocks glass or a highball glass, so super great versatile, shot. yeah. Yep, great job. Whatever you have at arm's reach. Keeping it easy. For garnish, we're gonna add a few strawberry slices, a little stalk of lemongrass, twist. And there we have it. That's it? That is it. Easy peasy. All right. That's a beautiful drink for very few steps. Yes. So what do you have for us? I think I have a comparably beautiful drink with a one more step maybe. Okay, okay. So keeping it easy still. And we're going to use Grey Goose Original for this cocktail. And what I'm going to make in this beautiful V-shaped glass today. Love the vessel. Yeah. Love it's, it. it's called a long martini cocktail. So Kind of a riff on a classic martini, but we're gonna lengthen it out with a little ginger ale. So we're gonna start by using one and a half ounces of Grey Goose Original. And just like Leon, we're building right in the glass, keeping it simple, not requiring any other bar tools. And then next up, we're going to use three fourths of an ounce of Nolly Pratt Dry Vermouth. I love this product. It has nice botanicals in it. It gives it like kind of a nice springy feeling. And then we're going to use three and a half ounces of ginger ale, but if you don't want that gingery, peppery bite, you can use club soda and it makes an equally as beautiful cocktail. And then again, just gonna give it a little stir. Get everything mixed together in here. And I think it's fun to garnish with things that you can add in to enhance the cocktail if you want to. So mm -hmm. we're gonna garnish with a little bit of lemon just in case you wanted to squeeze that in there. The long martini cocktail. Now that's the way to keep your summer drinks classy. And classic. Which one would you want to try? We want to know in the comments. And for more great drink recipes, click below.